pulling up some Cadillac Eldorados. Apparently that's the sickest bucket seats you can put into a Bel Air. So we're gonna check and see what we find. Hopefully they have something other than like the peanut butter leather. That way we won't have to cover them. Uh, I don't wanna have to reupholster them, obviously. Uh, but they're $26.99 a seat. Heated 12 position adjustable lumbar. All that bullshit. So we shall see what happens. They're definitely worse views as far as junkyards go. Long time no see, guys. Just checking in. I've been super busy. Been doing a Motard conversion on this for a friend. So finally got some street tires on it and tubes. So now it will be technically street legal, lights and everything else. But I found some 1997 Cadillac Eldorado seats. 12 position adjustable. I think it has lumbar support, but it mainly has heat and leather. It'll be like a high back bucket seat. So they'll look pretty good in the car. They'll fit. I've yanked the seats out of here and all the garbage. So now I'm getting down to cleaning the carpet and prepping the floorboard to receive the seats. I gotta make some step down brackets since you can see here it's a little lower on the outside than it is on the inside. So I think it was an inch and a quarter step down here and then it'll be even. So I'm gonna start fitting the seat, seeing if I can get it in here nicely and evenly and then I'll bracket it up and go from there. So I finally got the seats installed. The back I'm still gonna have to trim a little anyway once I do the body drop for the airbag. So I'm not gonna trim the back until then. I've just got it in place just to kind of see how it fits. Works pretty good so far. I'll have to build a little box around the bottom to kick it up the way it's supposed to be. The fronts are in, they fit good, they're adjustable. The heat is all wired up and works. I've got the center console ready to go. I just gotta cut the shifter out, put the new shifter in and uh, put the console in. So that'll be next. Now that I've massaged that until it pretty much fits, I can tack it in one corner and press it down the rest of the way as I go. And that'll be sealed up. I can carpet over that and put in the center console. Next, I need to punch a hole for the new cable alignment that I'm gonna have to do. So I'm gonna tack this in and then I'll get to that. All right, ugly, but not going anywhere. So I'm gonna seal it, paint it, a little carpet over it, and then I'm gonna start sizing up this center console to see where I need to cut. All right, I got the center console in. The shifter works like it should. I still gotta put some stuff up here to finish off the top, but I've got an ashtray, the heat switches for the seats, cup holders, armrest, Everything's working. I will probably turn the lock for this into a dual USB charger. Same thing on the back. I'll probably put a dual USB here and power these fans somehow to push heat. And the heat works. There is lumbar, multiple positions. They all work. So finally done with that. Next, I will move on to chopping the floor and doing airbag suspension, so tune in for that. Got a season finale coming up soon, so hopefully you guys enjoy that. Click that like button if you like the video, subscribe if you wanna see more, and as always guys, keep on modding.